I just wanted to say a big thank you to people who seldom get praise. I wanted to say a big thank you to the cleaners of the world. Imagine a world where there were no cleaners. We would soon be buried beneath mountains of rubbish. The streets would be knee deep in litter. Our offices and factories would be rat infested flea pits. In the 14th century, a great plague swept through Europe. Half the world's population died. The Black Death was caused by rats and the fleas they carry. There were so many rats because there were so few cleaners. The streets were filthy and the rats lived among the filth. People did not understand the importance of cleanliness to health. Nowadays, people do understand the importance of hygiene. But hardly anyone notices the people who are responsible for keeping our world clean. Our society produces a never ending river of waste. Look at the amount of waste you produce every day. Multiply it by the population of your town or city. Now multiply it by the population of the world. Currently, there are about 7 billion people. Then consider that there's an army of men and women whose job is to dispose of all this waste. But we never notice these important people, do we? Cleaners tend to clean when everyone else has gone home. They start early in the morning or late at night. Or they work out of sight in places we are happy to forget exist. but they don't get a lot of money for their work. They are undervalued.
most people consider cleaning to be beneath them. I worked in a hospital and never once saw a doctor holding a mop. What am I, the cleaner? They would have said if asked to clean. Maybe you've said it yourself. Yet without the hospital cleaners, the doctors could not work. So cleaners have low status, while doctors have high status. Cleaners often have to have two jobs just to make ends meet. Cleaners are only really noticed when they aren't there. They become conspicuous by their absence. When the bin men are on strike, the streets soon fill with rubbish. The dustbins overflow, and there are piles of rubbish rotting in the streets. Even if you don't see it, you can certainly smell it. Then the dustmen come back with their dust carts, and the streets are clean again. This demonstrates how important cleaners are. We want to live in a clean world. We deplore filth and dirt and dust and litter. We need cleaners. We need cleaners to come along with their brooms, mops, and buckets. In their overalls, they sweep our streets. With their rubber gloves, cloths, detergents, and disinfectants, they clean our toilets. With their buckets and mops, they mop our floors. With their vacuum cleaners, they suck up the dust from our carpets. And they clean away the dust and the dust mites that cause allergies. And they dust our furniture with their dusters. And they polish our surfaces with their polish. And we hardly notice these very important people. So the next time you see a cleaner working hard to brighten your world, take.
take a moment to say thank you. If you're a cleaner, I'd like to say thank you for your work. And I'd like to tell you that I really appreciate what you do for the rest of us.